Now today is the launch of a brand new series. We've never Woo! done anything like this before. Or oh, whether this is my new co. <laughs> new series. I'm so excited to finally be collaborating with Stack. We are bringing you a new series where we are going to show you places you probably haven't seen before. Underground bars, hole in the wall cafes, offices with a twist. It's going to be great. Absolutely. And we're going to call this series Taste Makers. Now, not taste in terms of food taste, mm -hmm. but more of design taste, if you know what I mean. That's right. But because I'm here, you can be assured there's definitely going to be a bit of food. We're here today between both Boat Key and Clark Key, slightly off the beaten track, if you will, at North Canal Road. This is the quieter side of Boat Key as opposed to the flip side where some of us started our clubbing journey. Today, we're actually going to a bar and it's unlike anything that you've ever seen before. It's a whole different concept. My name is Dean Chiu. I do music. I run a label called Darkening Wax. I run a spatial design consultancy called Drawn. I have always wanted to run another space in my own terms, create spatial conditions for my community to thrive. Because over the years, we've built a, a very robust community in music through Darkening Wax and stuff. I must admit, I was a bit crazy, but also fueled by a passion in wanting to create uh, another spot. Because I knew that there would be a exodus of spaces where people can try. That's my intention, like to use off track as a conduit to bring in fresh wave of energy and positivity into the city in a post pandemic world. And I guess I'm always very attuned and very sensitive to the way people move through a space, yeah, yeah. how they react. You know that your space blew up on TikTok. Yeah, I know. <laughs> How do you feel about that? <laughs> um, to be honest, I'm, I'm quite amused by it. I love my gram, I'm a gram user. I'm, hey. a, I'm, a, I'm a gram fiend. Yeah, it's a Gen Z thing. I'm too old for that shit. <laughs> oh. And you really went off track, right? Because the signage was supposed to be here, but now it's here. Rip it out, I saw this, I was like, I'm gonna keep that because I, yeah. I, I really could visualize what I could do with it, right? Yeah. And then new versus old, old yeah. versus new. So this is a sort of like the waiting zone. I always like that transition from the five foot way into a space where you are not brutally confronted by the entrance, but you recess it. So you could just easily, you know, yeah. waltz in, sit down, look to the inside, say hi to the bartender, get your drink. So. Okay, can you evaluate my uh, artistic interpretation? Yes. So the standard walkway, <laughs> you yes. broke it up and this becomes a bit crazy fun. It's like an invitation to the, to the like fun inside. See, this, I mean, is, this is why wow. he is my co-host. Wow. There's you're going to make me lose my job <laughs> basically as well. Right? We noticed this just now. That yeah. There's a high hole at the top of the door. Yeah, it's absolutely. almost like, you know those ship, right? Those ship yes. cabin windows? Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Those oh, portals. Those, those portals. Like, yeah. What's the reason behind that? I mean, I kind of want people to just get curious, you know, yeah. see the light, see the artwork, peep inside, but without being able to see too much, you know, yeah. and obviously I mischievously made it quite high. Yeah, in my high. for himself again. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But then you almost have to go like, yo, okay. Right. And then you go in. Right. So okay. it's a little bit more exclusive, you yeah. know, you're wondering what's going on. What's going on? So this all this temptation, too. I cannot resist anymore. Like, 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 I think it's time to go. Like, 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 let's go, let's go, let's do it. Whoa. Yes. Welcome to the uh, wow. domain. Um, thank you, thank guys. you. <laughs> well, I, uh, yeah. It's such a such a difference, like on the outside it's all brutal. Yeah. And then you come in, it's like home. Home, exactly. nice. Yeah. Paid a lot of attention to the details, to the artwork, yeah. to the artifacting of the space, to the lights, you know. The, yeah, I just want people to feel like they're entering a, a living room. Exactly. Space, I, mean, yeah. I think like what you say about the energy, right? Because some bars I've been to are really quite intimidating. Yes. Yeah. Yes. But this like, just feels easy. It's like an explosion of senses when you come in, mm. right? It's like mm. the eyes, the, yeah. the, the calm, the hearing, the, the yeah. smell. Yeah. Like, yeah. That's right. Yeah. Mm. And I specifically wanted this whole jazz theme right. uh, in, in the space. And obviously, if you if you take your eyes to this one, this lovely piece above the bar, uh -huh. that's done by a Singaporean artist called Reza Hasni. Yeah. So that's actually the speakers that we have in the space, oh. which I can show you later. Nice. So okay. yeah, everything is quite intentional, basically. Yeah. yeah. So we noticed there's a sticker wall. Yeah. Um, and we will uh, commit to making our own sticker, then we will stick on. Confirm, we better. To, to make our mark. Massive, like, I can space. <laughs> yeah, yeah, just stick it right there. Pack boards are actually, they're quite cheap materials. Mm. They're very lo-fi, but also acoustically, they absorb sound. Oh. So I've actually had fiberglass installation behind these pack boards as well. Oh. So you can really dampen the sound across the space. Wow. So when you sit down, obviously, again, to the comfort of 
your customers, right? Wow. You, you feel comfortable in the space without having to scream or like yeah. sound bouncing across yes. different corners of the space. Oh. And um, also, I can always just uh, position uh, my yeah. records or like even an artwork at different positions mm. well. because of the packs. You mm. can use these hooks, mm. DIY, IKEA vibes, yeah. you know, like just <laughs> place them around. So you have obviously the circular communal table. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, and then obviously you have a very long one over there, so that's flanking uh, this selectors corner. I would, I would call it where we invite mm. different selectors to come and play some vinyl, share some music. Mm. The 3D circular disc, ah. which actually we kept from the KTV. Oh, so when I saw this in the, in the original space, I thought I could really tweak something with this, right? So and then did, I kept wait, it. This is from the KTV, <laughs> which oh, has wow. become like the, the trademark of the space. I would have never guessed. Yeah, yeah. To, yeah. yes. Yeah. I know everyone was quite surprised when I told this story. So this is the uh, nice little corner. You can see it's uh, yeah, we uh, one of our labor of love here, like uh, proper old school clips, uh, La Scala speakers mm -hmm. occupying uh, the corners of the room. Mm -hmm. You know how yeah. certain spaces when you go in, the music is always too loud. Exactly. You can't really hear yourself, right? Yeah. But these speakers are because of the way they are shaped. Mm -hmm. They're like horns, cabinet speakers. So basically, the sound I travels remember. around yeah. around you, not straight into oh. your ears. So you can you can basically sit down here without getting your ears like, wow. yeah, and you can talk over the corner. Yeah. So when we demolished all the previous bonus were here, I saw that and I was like, yo, I have to keep that. Mm. Because there's a traditional. Heritage wrought iron, uh, you know, yeah. ventilation windows, oh, the grills. Okay. I kept that, put a plywood panel behind just to act as a backlit sort of uh, effect so you can see. Uh, that like, shadow uh, effect is, is intentional. It's intentional. Ooh. Yeah. And obviously, all these irregularities on the walls, yeah. all these like patinas, I kept it yeah. uh, painted like a mustard yellow. Obviously, very accentuated by the, the cold lighting. Uh. But you have this like very Imperfect yeah. texture. Character. It's a little bit like the outside, right? That's it's right. a little bit rugged. Yeah. A bit rugged. Oh. We're done with the inside space. There is yes. still one more portion. Oh, yes. <gasps> We're going to show you this little uh, okay, yes. secret. Okay. Behind, the yes, behind, the behind the curtains. Behind the curtains. Oh. Let's go, guys. Yeah, this is the TikTok the spot that TikTok everyone spot. will. Wow. Yeah. Usually, nobody really cares for the back space, yes. but you really made something out of it. Yeah, and then there are the, the, the same themes running throughout. You've got the greens, you've got the like sort of untreated yes. walls, walls. Yeah. you've got the flooring. With the, the flooring. Outside, exactly the and then uh, the neon. The, the neon, neon going on. Yeah. Wow. So you can see my obsession. <laughs> if this was dull, if this was grey, right? Exactly. Very dull. No. You yeah. won't feel anything. Exactly. I wish it was called Tastemakers <laughs> and I'm a man of good taste. Yeah, well. Yes. <laughs> I mean, obviously. I can be the maker. Like, I will no, 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 do the hammering. I'll be the builder. I'll be the builder. I'll be the builder. I'll be the builder. All of us making things together. Uh, but really, really like, like heads off because I think it's not easy but you managed to make all these components come together and Thank you, man. shine. Yeah. Appreciate it. I really yeah. appreciate it. One final segment, right? Oh, I can't believe I almost forgot. That's how amazed I am. Yes. <laughs> the segment I've been waiting for, it's time. Makan, makan. Okay, so we have got three different dishes here, all vegetarian. Okay, so let's yes. go. Yeah. Chart asparagus and then topped with a lot of peanuts, sesame seed, yeah. sort of a tag, right? Because it's like sour, sweet, mm -hmm. the textures of the peanut, wow. That's peanuts, good. yes. This is the burnt chili dip. Mm. I have no idea what, what's in this. Mm. Let's... The bit is super interesting. Mm. Wow, eh. it's chili, la. burnt chili. Burnt chili. Yeah. <laughs> Dude. Oh. Oh, right? right? <laughs> Whoa. The thing that hits me, like hits you first is the char. I get that burst of flavour. Yeah. I'm like, wow. Yeah. Sometimes that burnt taste is too much. Mm. But this enhances it. Alright, full show host already. Hey, what? What am I new calling? Hey, this one allegedly the hot favourite here. Oh, is it? Mm. Let's do it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Ayo, ayo. So We're calling it. Up, yeah, like. <laughs> We want behind the camera. Like, no, like, we don't want to see that. These yeah. two weirdos. <laughs> oh my god, really just like Indomie. Remember what he said? Just now he said Indomie. Okay, so besides the food, right, we've got very cool coasters that Dean designed himself. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So if you scan it, right, it will lead you to this playlist where you can basically recreate the ambience of. Right. Of off track. Yeah. But it's only one part of it because obviously you have to come here to experience the food, yeah. the smells. Yeah. Yeah, but Pretty he good. really thought about this whole thing holistically. Yes. Right? Yes, like yeah. down to. Even the coasters. Well, I'm not gonna ask you to rate, but I'm gonna ask you what's your favorite dish here. My favorite dish today has to be the Green Goddess because I felt like it surprised me the most. It looks like asparagus, yeah. but then the flavors and the textures just 
attacked and it was okay. like the most surprising. Right. But yours is the, you know, the you bunch chili dip. Has to be the dip. Yeah, I saw it in your eyes just now. Yeah, yeah. When we ate it, like he was like, Ding. with the bread half in his mouth, he was like. <laughs> All, right. All right. So I guess that about wraps up the tour for today. We've mm -hmm. seen quite a few things. We've got some design elements. Uh, we had the food as well. And Dean, who is just an incredible guy. I think Dean was really the heart of this episode oh, today. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. it's, the, it's the first time we're hosting together, right? Yes. But Dean just really helped to make everything gel. Yeah, He's yeah, so yeah, energetic, yeah. so kind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All his sort of expertise in life yes. came out to this one project yeah. during yeah. a pandemic. I think that's super mind-blowing. Right? It's yeah. like, yeah. and apologies to Dean if you don't like us calling you hipster. Yeah. It's such, sometimes it's such an overused sometimes word. It's, yeah. it's like vibe. Yeah. He but used he vibe also like TikTok. So it's <laughs> okay. okay, yeah, that's true. Yeah. Okay. Are you into TikTok? Can I just say, yes. I watch Stack like a lot. Yeah, yes. I watch every episode confidently, I can yeah. say, of Living In. Uh, yeah. Did you say Living In? Yeah, Living In. So, so in, inside the tour, did you. What? Oh yeah, I watched Living In, but um, what's, what's Insider Tour? I'm very sure I watched Insider Tour. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah, sure you yeah. did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but anyway, guys, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much for watching. Please let us know in the comment section uh, if there are any other cool spaces that you want us to check yes. out. Yes, don't forget to like this episode. It means so much to us. And one final thing, Aiken. Yes, guys, don't forget, you can also check out my YouTube channel. You can subscribe to it. I've got content coming out all through the months. Very nice. Um, uh, but don't yeah. just subscribe to my channel, please. Don't forget to subscribe to Stack as well. Yeah, and watch Insider Tour, okay? And Thank watch you. Insider yes. Tour. Okay. And of course, this is show. Okay, yeah. but we're right. going back to off track to party. We're going to party. Right. Okay, ciao. Bye. 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 Bye.